Good evening, I'm Alicia Richards. And I'm Dennis Owens. Thanks so much for joining us tonight. Acting Secretary of Health Allison Beam held a news conference today unveiling a new report on breakthrough COVID cases. Brian Munoz joins us live with our top story. Brian. Good evening. Yes, uh, health officials continue to say the vaccine is the way out. Now we're getting a better sense of just how many cases are from the unvaccinated. The acting health secretary visited Lancaster County today to talk numbers. Allison Beam says right now most COVID-19 cases, hospitalizations and deaths are occurring in people who are unvaccinated. Between January 1 and September 7, 2021, there have been 35,389 identified post-vaccination cases, among a total of 639,729 positive cases. Beam says those numbers reinforce the message that the vaccine is doing its job, even as the Delta variant continues to spread. We always knew from the beginning that even the mRNA vaccines were 95% effective. So 5% of the time, people were going to get an infection. What we were hoping for is that infection would be mild and that infection would not result in hospitalization or death. And the vaccines are doing that. Hospitals continue to manage an overflow of cases. Wait times may be getting longer. And Dr. Rybczynski says this latest surge is putting a stress on Lancaster County hospitals. It's over 80 hospitalized on average last week. It's concerning to us because it takes beds. It takes beds away from people that may be holding off on care. Uh, when you think about advanced cancer treatment, cardiovascular treatment, and they're coming in asking for services. But as hesitancy continues to threaten the progress, Dr. Rybczynski has this message for the roughly 50% of people in the county who still haven't gotten their first shots. Think about getting vaccinated to protect those, your loved ones around you and the community. The health secretary admitted that the hospital data is not perfect, that they're working with individual hospitals to get them to report the most up-to-date information from a number of sources. Live in Lancaster, Brian Munoz, ABC 27 News.